Hello guys, so this is again your Sir Ariel and today uh, magdi-discuss na naman tayo. Okay, panibagong lecture na naman, panibagong lesson and hopefully lahat ay nanood ng ating mga previous videos para makarelate dito sa video natin na ito. So dapat napanood nyo yung video natin yesterday or yung previous video natin, yung differentiation of logarithmic function para ma-appreciate nyo itong um, differentiation of exponential function kasi um, gagamitin natin yung ln dito, yung logarithmic functions dito and sa ibang examples natin dito. Okay? So, let's discuss. Itong discussion natin dito is again, um, part ng differentiation of transcendental functions. So, tapos na tayo dun sa logarithmic functions. Next na tayo dito sa exponential function. And parang dun sa logarithmic functions lang din, mayroon lang kayong dalawang minemorize na formula. Dito, we only have two formulas to, um, to solve for the derivative of a function. So, here, the first one is the derivative of a constant raised to a function um, that is differentiable with respect to u so or that is i uh, with respect to x so that is your a raised to u yung a mo dito is a constant okay a constant number so ang constant number raised to u is equal to ang derivative nun class is a raised to u so you just copy the given function times the logarithm uh, the natural logarithm of a the constant times you get the derivative of your exponent u and then the second one is and the derivative of e raised to u is equal to e raised to u so you just copy the function times yung derivative ng iyong exponent para mas mapadali yan parang magiging e raised to u du ganun pag hindi mo muna i kakapi si dx sa baba niya okay so let's solve some examples para ma-appreciate nyo yung ating mga formulas. Okay. So, number one. Y is equal to 4 raised to 2x. So, that is parang y. Ang constant natin ay si 4. So, that is equal to a. Ang 2x natin yan yung u natin raised to u. And we know that the derivative of y equals a raised to u. So, y prime is just equal to copy, your, um, copy the given function times ln of a times the derivative of your exponent u with respect to x. So, dito class, ang given natin dyan, ang a natin is 4. Tama ba? Ang u natin is 2x. Ang then derivative ni u with respect to x is equal to 2. Then we substitute sa ating formula. So, y prime now or that is your dy over dx is equal to a raised to u, so that is 4 raised to 2x times the ln of a, so ang a natin is 4, ln of 4 times the derivative of u with respect to x, that is 2. Okay, in the previous video, meron tayong example na ganito, hindi, um, yung 4 and 2, hindi nyo po sila multiply, so that's ln of 8, no. Okay, so kasi mangyari dyan, multiplier si 2 sa ln of 4, so that is equal to 4 raised to 2x times 2 ln of 4. And we know that, okay, di ba ang a ln of b that is equal to ln of b raised to a. Magiging exponent si a. So dito si 2 magiging exponent ni 4. So magiging 4 raised to 2x times ln of 4 squared. Or that is equal to 4 raised to 2x times ln of 16. Okay, so that is the derivative of y equals 4 raised to 2x. Okay, so next example, number 2. That is equal to y equals 3 raised to 4x. So, hindi ko na yung sulat yung formula A, idediretso na natin. So, that is dy all over dx is equal to a raised to u. So, ang a mo dyan is 3 Ang u mo dyan ay si 4x. So, magiging a raised to u. So, 3 raised to 4x times ln of a, that is 3, times derivative ni u, that is 4. So, magiging 3 raised to 4x times 4 ln of 3. Or, 
3 raised to 4x times ln times 3 raised to uh, ln of 3 raised to 4. So ano ang 3 raised to 4? That is 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 that is 81. Okay? Ln of 81. So that is the derivative of 3 raised to 4x. Okay? Next, we have five examples, by the way. Kaya mag, magsasawa kayo sa examples. Okay, ito naman. Nag-combine ang 4 raised to x at saka ln of 4x. So, sabi ko sa inyo, kailangan nyo panoorin yung previous video natin, yung derivative o uh, differentiation of logarithmic functions para ma-appreciate nyo to. So, nag-multiply ang 4 raised to x ln of 4x. Same process doon sa mga rules of differentiation. Pag nag-multiply, kagamitin natin ang product rule. Basta walang mawawala doon. And ano ang product rule natin? <clears throat> ang product rule natin is given u v class. Diba? That is u times the derivative of v plus v times the derivative of your u. Here, so 4 raised to x times ln of 4x, ang u mo dito is si 4 raised to x, and then ang v mo is si ln of 4x. So, dy all over dx, basta wag lang mawawala sa formula, u mo, okay, that is 4 raised to x, times the derivative of your v. Diba ang derivative ni ln of u, okay, diba ang derivative niya na class is the derivative of your ln of u is equal to, um, 1 all over u times the derivative of your u with respect to x. Or kung tanggalin mo muna to para mas mabilis i-memorize, that's just equal to du all over u. Na? So, the um, derivative ni u ko is 4x. Diba? So, sige, sulat natin ng buong buo. 1 all over u, that is 1 all over 4x times derivative ni u. So, derivative ni 4x, that is 4. Tama? Okay, plus v, so that is ln of 4x, times derivative ni u so that is 4 raised to x so that is a raised to u okay a raised to u so that is 4 raised to x ln of 4 times derivative of x is 1 so that is just equal to 4 raised to x times ln of 4 so pwede ko rin i-cancel si 4 dito so ang may e1 is 4 raised to x all over x plus ln of 4x ln of 4x times um, 4 raised to x ln of 4. Tama ba? Okay, yes. I can bring out here 4 raised to x kasi pareha sila dito. Tama? So that is 4 raised to x times 1 all over x then plus ln of 4 ln of 4x. Tama ba? 4 raised to x, 1 over x, ln of 4, okay? That is ln of 4x. So, yan ang kanyang sagot. 4 raised to x times 1 over x plus ln of 4, ln of 4x. Okay? So, still product rule. Huwag mamawala doon. Okay? Okay? Next tayo. Okay. So, E naman tayo. Um, derivative ni E raised to U is equal to E raised to U times derivative ni U with respect to X. Okay? Simple as that. So, ito, ang U mo dito is negative 4X. And the derivative ni U is negative 4 so, ang dy all over dx, okay, ang simple, di ba? E raised to u, e raised to negative 4x times um, du is, ay, ang u, o, oh, tama, negative 4. So, that is equal to negative 4 e raised to negative 4x. Okay? So, that is your dy all over dx. Simple as that. 
And then, the last one, last four, okay, ito. Medyo cute to. Another product rule. Another product rule, tsaka um, exponential rule. Okay? Exponential rule, tsaka product rule. So, gagamitin natin, ang u ko dito is si e raised to x. Ang v natin dito ay si e, e raised to ln of x. So, still, pag product rule, u derivative ni v plus v derivative ni u. Magiging dy all over dx u that is e raised to x times derivative ni v so ano ang derivative ni e raised to u na class that is e raised to u du wherein ang e raised to ang u niya dyan is ln of x di ba ang derivative ni ln of x i di ba apag ln is 1 all over u du so 1 all over x times derivative ni x is 1 so ito class ang derivative nito is 1 all over x lang Okay, so that is e raised to u, du, so e raised to u times the derivative ni u, which is ln of x, times 1 all over x. So that is equal to, ang derivative ni e raised to ln of x is e raised to u all over x. So copy ko dito ay e raised to, wherein yung u mo pala dito is ln of x, tama? So ln of x. So that is e raised to ln of x, so e raised to u times derivative ni ln of x is 1 all over x, diba? So time over x na lang. Plus v, e raised to ln of x times derivative ni u, e raised to u, so that is e raised to x times u, derivative ni u, which is x, so derivative ni x is 1, so times 1, no need to write. So anong common class? Common si e raised to x, e raised to ln of x. Tama ba? So, pwede kong ilabas na e raised to x times e raised to ln of x plus e, ay hindi na, mamultiply na pala, e, ilalabas pala natin yon Draw. So, times, may iwan dito is pag natanggal to, di ba parang times 1 all over x yan class, di ba? So, may name 1 all over x plus matanggal tong buong to, tong term na to, plus 1 na lang. Okay. I-check nyo to class. Di ba parang pag binaba ko yan, magiging... Di ba, um, ito class, ang itsura nito is magiging x na lang to. Di ba? Di ba, pag e raised to ln, magiging x na lang siya. May makakansal yan, may iwan si x. So parang magiging e raised to x times x. Di ba? Kasi parang itsura niyan, magiging pag binaba ko tong exponent ng ln of x, parang x ln of e, ito times 1. So, magiging x, so 1 all over x plus 1. So, magiging e raised to x times x, simplify ko to, x, kunin ko yung common denominator, which is 1, then 1 plus x. Then, cancel, cancel. So, ang sagot dyan, class, is e raised to x times 1 plus x. So, that is your dy all over dx. Okay? Or, if you wish to simplify that one, ang magiging itsura nito, class, is parang e raised to x times x lang siya. Okay? So, that's it. The derivative of your e raised to x times e raised to ln of x is equal to e raised to x times 1 plus x. Okay? So, if you have questions, um, just put it in the comment section and then we try to answer them. Thank you for watching.